What's up YouTubers? Johnny DIY here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to improve the cooling with your refrigerator by cleaning your condenser coils. If you guys are new to this channel, please consider subscribing. I do a lot of these household DIYs and automotive projects. All right, let's get to this one. So first thing on a double door one like this is we're going to go ahead and open it up. And there's a plastic cover down here in the front. You're just going to go ahead and pull on the sides on each side. And this whole cover just comes out. Now we can go ahead and vacuum this cover off. But also, we're going to go ahead and clean underneath. Clean all that out. Because look at that. That is all gunk up. <laughs> Alright, if you look in the back, you can see those black coils. Those are the uh, back of the coils for the condenser. We're getting clean. Now we're going to want to pull out our fridge. Ugh. Now I'll go ahead and unplug the fridge so we can have some more room. Also be careful if you have a water dispenser not to pull that uh, line too uh, far. Okay, now if you have an older fridge with like the freezer on top and the fridge on the bottom, your coils will probably be exposed up on the back and you can just clean them that way. But if you've got a newer fridge, they've mostly got these uh, little back panels. You're just going to want to go ahead and unscrew this back panel and we'll take it off. just has about a few screws, five or ten. We'll take that off. I guess it only had about five. So you just go ahead and pull this panel off. We'll clean that too. You're going to want to clean your fridge at least once or twice a year. I usually do it in summer when it gets really hot because that's when usually your fridge starts running a little warmer. Alright, so here's all the coils on the right and you can see it's pretty dusty in there. I'll just go to town vacuuming. <sighs> nice and clean. An old toothbrush and a can of air really makes quick work of getting in back into these nooks and crannies. Go ahead and put our cover back on. Plug our fridge back in. Push our fridge back in. Snap our front cover back on. There we go. Check out how much dust was under that fridge. And I just cleaned that thing about a year ago. Alright guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up for me, check out my page, uh, consider subscribing, and I also made a Patreon page if you want to help me support, help support me on that too. Alright guys, thanks for watching Johnny DIY, keep on doing it yourself, take care, and keep your fridge cool.